Hey guys, it's Sherry of Sherry's Plans, and today I wanted to film with you guys um, a desk tour, so stay tuned for that. So this is what my desk normally looks like. I wanted to share with you guys just kind of what my setup looks like, and this is... Like I said, this is how it normally looks when I don't move stuff around to make room for like photos of certain um, products and items on my desk. This is what I've got and this is what I use. So, so I keep a stack of my planners over here on the side and I'll leave them open to the day or the week, whatever it is. And it just makes it easier for me to see what I've got going on on my schedules or what goals I'm working on, what tasks I have to do. Um... Let's see, I'm trying to see if this is the best way I'm gonna film this for you guys. Back here, I have a planner stand and that is from Erin Condren. I'll link that in the description of this video. So on the planner stand, I usually just have the um, Cultivate What Matters power sheets and that is just reminding me of my goals that I have set for this month. But like today um, is my day off. So I do planning in my passion planner daily for my, my day off. So I'll put that up there just to like keep those tasks um, in the forefront of what I've got to do today. So like I said, on my desk, I've got my Moxie Life Planner and that is open up, like I said, to the week where I've got some of my tasks written on there. I also have my Aaron Condren vertical here um, decorated and set up for the week so I can see what I've got going on. In the back here, I've got a checklist, a petite planner checklist from Erin Condren. And what I've been doing in that is using it to mark off each day. Am I checking in with, um, am I checking in with my Moxie Life? Am I checking in with my Erin Condren, my daily, if I'm using it, my gold planner um, power sheets back here, making sure I'm checking in with a little bit of everything. Um, my wellness log, which I have not been doing for the past few weeks, but I'll use that to kind of like check off Am I checking, what planners am I checking in with? So I make sure that I get in with everything. Um, moving back here, I have, this is the acrylic, this is the acrylic uh, nesting organizer tray from Erin Condren. I've got all the pieces. So there's like this, I've, I've showed it all in another video, but um, I've got like all of the pieces sitting in here um, just because I kind of like liked them like this. I've got stickers from my sticker shop here in the front. These are the ones I use most often. Uh, this little tray has uh, whiteout, my favorite whiteouts and uh, glue tape back there. And then this caddy has just some of my favorite pens and other planning tools in here. I love this layers notepad. I use this actually guys, so I use this a lot for is like testing colors of my highlighters and markers and seeing like how well those match up with my layout. So that's what I use a lot of this for. Um, I've got this little candle. This is from a company. It is called Northeast Southwest, if I remember that name correctly. But they have candles. They're based in California. They have candles with different scents from California. And I used to live in California and I've got a lot of lovely memories of California and visiting some places there. So Cambria is one of the places I had visited on vacation and I have that candle scent from them. I've got two other ones that I'll have to share with you guys at some point, but that's the candles. I have, this is my Villa Beautiful pin collection here. This uh, stand is from Amazon. It was only like 12 or $13 maybe, but it holds a lot of pins. Like, um, I'm not even using like half of these. So it, it holds a lot of pins. Um, I also have, these are some of the um, destine trays from Erin Condren that I'm using. I have got my pins, my highlighters that match my Moxie Live uh, goal planning colors here. I've got um, this little bin here that's got, you know, some of my favorite mild liners and it's got my passion planner markers and my Erin Condren highlighters back there. And then this bin just, um, this mug just holds all of my markers and some cute little llama pens I have back there. I've got this uh, colorful prism ruler here, uh, my desk calendar in the back there. This is a uh, washi organizer drawer sets. I've got two, the top here is all uh, simply gilded. The bottom here is I've got a little bit of everything from washi tape warrior. Um, there's some planner Kate in here, Aaron Condren washi and just all everything else over there. 
So I usually have my very dirty iPad that sits there. I watch movies or TV on it. Um, I have this, this whole organizer set here, this shelf. Seems to be super popular. I'll link it in, um, it's from Amazon. I'll link that too if I can find it. But I love this for like organizing, just kind of getting stuff up elevated, but it's allowing me to like stack up all of my, um, I've got some like notebooks and more notebooks. And it just allows me to like kind of keep everything organized and set up over there. So this little tray has, um, I keep this here, but it has like all of my petite wellness logs that I also want to make sure I'm checking in with regularly. And um, so I keep that tucked in down there. Sometimes like my wellness log should be sitting um, over here in this pile. But like I said, I haven't been keeping up with it the last few weeks. So I need to figure out what's working for me on that. Um, let's see. I've got just some binders. Has my Wild U classes stuff in it. Couple notebooks. My address notebook here. Um, up here is a um, rose gold uh, triangle folder, file folder thing. So Erin Condren has something similar to that that's gold on their website. Before they released their gold one, I had bought this rose gold one from Amazon and it was about the same price. So I keep like all of these uh, sticky notes up here and then I have like just a bunch of notepads, um, stuff that I'll use pretty often here. Uh, another soft bound notebook that was for my shop, a coloring book. These are the wild card pages from Cultivate What Matters, but Boutique Planners and some other mail up there. I keep, uh, just has all my um, organizer stuff there. That's my computer setup. I love this acrylic block. I finally got that from Erin Condren. I love the um, message of the design on there. And then I, oh, I also have the mid-century circle. These are the sticky notepad cubes. I have that there. I've got some wireless earbuds. And that is pretty much that setup there. So I love this L-shaped desk. My desk is from Ikea. I use this mat, it works as like a mouse pad. So, um, and I like keeping it over here to just um, keep my work area uh, kind of clean and uh, give me some space at the computer there. So the desk is from Ikea. I think I definitely wanna go like get this, this one, like get it in bigger size so I can like fill up my little gap that I have over here and it would just kind of fill the space more because I feel like a lot of stuff's really crowded and cluttered. I personally like having everything really close within arm's reach. Um, so I like, it looks kind of busy. Like to in some people's photos, it's like, in, you know, like the Instagram photos, like I feel like my setup's pretty busy. So that's why I move a lot of stuff when I take photos for Instagram but I really like my setup. I really like having everything so close here. So I want to kind of come over here and show you guys. I'm not going to give you guys a full tour because um, the rest of this is kind of a hot mess, but I kind of want to show you guys, this is my planner cart. And this is a little bit of a wider planner cart. I picked this up from Michael's. I'll see if I can link this as well. So I want to show you guys. So I've kind of got like I'm boxed in over here <laughs> with my planner cart and my desk set up around me. Um, so I have, this is my sticker collection. So a lot of Aaron, um, these are planner Kate sticker albums here, some Aaron Condren sticker, sticker albums. I've got some smaller sticker albums from some other shops here, more Aaron Condren out stickers in these albums and sticker books. And then this area was for where I was keeping my planners. So, Right now I've got like my large passion planner that I haven't used yet this year, but I have that sitting up here. Um, some covers, this is my recipe notebook that I wanna start working in. Um, so I kind of keep all that stuff like right there really close for me. Um, I've got my collection of Ollie clips on here. I love these. They are super strong magnetic clips. Like this is the large size and I love these. They're, they hold so many pages together. They're great for bookmarks. They're great for holding your place and your planners. I used them a lot in my petite planners when I was using those. So this is that collection there. I also keep some stencils up here with my Ollie clips as well. Down here on the second level, I have 
two pouches from Cultivate What Matters and they hold um, my sticker album and my markers and my washi tape from Cultivate What Matters that I use on my power sheets. So that's that. And then I have like my collection of sticker books here. I have sticker books from Happy Planner, View Happy Planner ones, and some from Passion Planner as well. And here I've got a bunch more um, markers and pens, stuff that I um, just kind of want to keep separate into the side here. I've got just a bin for more random stickers that I haven't found a place for. A whole bunch of Erin Condren cards here ready for me to um, grab it and see if I want to send somebody some Happy Mail. It's all really, right there really close. Down here on the bottom, I've got a um, another letter organizer tray from Erin Condren. Um, and down here, I've got like all of my sticker sheets, my leftovers from kits. I kind of just throw them all down here so I can sort them later. And it's been a while since I've sorted some stuff. I've got uh, just packets of um, stickers and washi and pens that I'm not using that I'm getting ready to um, post for sale or... Um, give it to somebody at some point. And then I have this accordion pouch down here with more pins. And these were pins I used to have on my desk, but I did notice that like I wasn't using them as often. So I wanted to keep them close, like I said, but off of my desk. So they're living down here in this accordion pouch right now. So that's, that's my planner cart. Just a really quick, that's the planner cart and my office set up here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know a lot of people have been asking me for like an office tour or a desk tour. So I really just wanted to get something out here for you guys. And I hope, um, I want to show you guys too really quick what I've got up here on my wall. So I've got, okay, my one of my lights sits right up here on top of that washi tape drawer. But I've got a calendar. This is from Bloom um, calendar. I just really like having like that pretty wall calendar there. I've got also this whiteboard with some stickers and stuff that I've just, you know, put magnets on there, um, stuff that I've liked and kept up there. And then I also have this um, like tack board up here too. So that's kind of how I've got that all decorated. And this stuff just sits over my desk right here. So I hope you guys enjoyed my um, little office desk tour. Um, I know a lot of people have been asking to see my my real life setup. So this is what it really looks like. And then when I go to film, like I just move all this stuff out of the way and bring up the, you know, my recording arm and everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, it was fun just to kind of show you guys what I've got and what I use. And like I said, I'll try to like, link some of these items in the description on this video. So please remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching my desk setup. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.